guys welcome to my channel if you're new here my name is Maggie and uh, last video if you've seen the last video I was talking about my surgeries last time and um, if you guys are new here uh, the history of uh, the last video was um, I was I was diagnosed again with breast cancer and that I am uh, dealing with all those kind of you know things that they need to do for me my surgeries and all that so I'm not completely healed healed I wouldn't say completely healed when it comes to the surgery I'm still recovering I would say however I started um, doing my workout I need my heart to be really really strong for the um, the chemotherapy come next week I still don't have the date they haven't uh, contacted me yet so I'm not so sure when they're gonna call me um, I'll probably have to you know maybe chat with my doctor about it um, hopefully I'll you hopefully will be able to do it next week because I really need that to be that week because I have gigs in between and I'm trying to make sure that around that time uh, my uh, my white blood cells already are shooting up otherwise I won't be able to go ahead and perform but um, I'll, I'll do my best I'll do my best to you know keep the schedules aligned because I just really want to get this out of my system right now um, anything new anyways uh, this week I had um, it's still healing right now and I don't know if you can see it's not even see that these are all scabs over here and the over there so they're shading already and some of them you know really there's the like the strokes I don't know how it's gonna look like until it's completely healed I had uh, well I'm talking about microblading so um, yeah I, I, I'm just waiting for it to heal and the reason why I had that because I know I'm gonna lose all the hair on my face and everything in my body including my my hair again so if you notice I've already cut it I just had it cut today I just don't want um, to see my hair falling off like really in clumps when I do the chemotherapy so what I'm trying to do right now is just to, to cut it you know have fun with it right now and then eventually once I start doing the chemo and I start seeing that hairs are falling off I'm gonna go ahead and shave it um, kind of do the GIJ thing I, that's what I called it GIJ thing <laughs> but anyways today's video is not super glammy this is just me getting ready uh, to see my friends it's gonna be not the last week you know but we're gonna still see each other it's just that I'm gonna be probably home all the time um, after the treatment at least one week after the treatment or every treatment is because I don't want to get sick or get infection uh, for those of you guys who don't know um, what that means is that if you're doing uh, treatment or chemotherapy um, I don't know with with uh, other you know medication but with mine and last time that I took as well is that if you get sick there's a huge possibility that you're gonna get infection and whatever sickness will, will develop because I didn't realize this that you know I, and I didn't know what white blood cell and red bl blood cell do to your body but for those of you guys who are into medical field white blood cells um, and for those who don't uh, white blood cells are kind of like your your um, what do you call that uh, support or kind of your your shield from from sickness so if you don't have that and you're low on that then you will freaking get sick so I got sick the first time I had the chemo because just because I didn't wash my apple properly and I got sick I had fever right away in like 30 minutes after taking it I don't know for some reason I guess my body is just you know down and uh, although I was feeling okay but then I got sick and that simple fever took me to the emergency room and I was there for four freaking days uh, I was able to see my husband but I they can't stay in my room I didn't see my kids because they said that it's a high risk uh, that I might get infection from the kids not that they are sick at that time but you know what uh, what that means that you know they, they are just not allowed at that point because they don't want me to get sick again but anyways I'm just gonna get ready and I will have a very very simple um, makeup today it's basically not a makeup it's just kind of to to give accent to your features already because you don't you don't really have to put a lot of makeup in your face and my husband he's not a number one fan when it comes to my channel because I'm talking about makeup I love makeup I love you know putting colors on my face but the thing is that he doesn't like that just because you know he doesn't like me putting makeup on 
All right, so what I'm gonna do, and I'm almost out of it. I love this. This is a Milani Makeup Blast. So I'm just gonna spray it all over. Whew. So that your makeup will actually stay. What I normally do is, um, sorry about that. <laughs> That's kind of like the stuff that my girls put on their hands. It's kind of like a tattoo. Um, but anyways, so before I used to spray it after the makeup, um, but this time I'm gonna go ahead and, and put it before the makeup. I'm not gonna put a lot of makeup right now. It's just to accent, you know, features on your face. So what I'm gonna do is I am gonna grab my, um, my L'Oreal True Match and my color is W6. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do that basically. All right, so all you need to do is just kind of pat it there. I'm really not putting a lot of makeup right now, so it's just that. I don't even use brush right now. It's just kind of like to give an even color on your skin. After that, we're gonna go ahead and move into contouring. I'm using a Wet n Wild um, Mega Glow Contouring Palette and um, very, very affordable. It's a drugstore brand. And we're just gonna go ahead and kind of put just a little bit of the contour. All right, so. course your nose you just have to contour your nose a little bit and like I said this is not like a really glam kind of makeup um, we're not doing that today and then of course you want to contour the bottom over here And don't forget your neck as well. It gives the illusion that you're skinny. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and grab my True Complexion Contour Palette. And as you can see, it looks like it's my favorite right now. Um, and I'm gonna grab the Sculpt and then just kind of um, put it like this on your cheeks. Just to give it a little color, nothing else. There we go. And I am gonna go ahead and grab, um, I'm a wet and wild girl, so I'm gonna go ahead and grab the Mega Glow Illuminating um, Palette, and it's like this. Somewhat, it's very, very um, subtle. It's not crazy glowy, but you can put it over here. Kind of give it a little glow because you're going out and it's in the afternoon. I don't want to look like uh, I have a mask or something, <laughs> so I'm just gonna put it that way. Very, very simple. Okay, um, we want to go ahead and accent your inner corner of your eye, and we're gonna do this. Okay, and I'm using Kiss, and this is a brow powder actually, but I really really like the, um, the shimmer on one of this uh, palette so you can see everything that's my favorite got that um, yep it's a drugstore brand that I'm using right now I'm ain't using a lot of um, heavy stuff well anyways I don't have any special <laughs> kind of brands that I'm using right now it's just whatever works to your you know to your skin or for your skin use it so right now we're gonna go ahead and go, go get an eyeliner and I'm using the matte style super last by essence and it looks like this one So there you are. So we're not gonna do the cat eyeliner. 
and let it dry over there. And I'm going to use, um, and right now I'm going to use for the lower lash line, we're going to use the NYX um, Ultimate Edit. And I'm choosing this one because I'm going to use uh, this color over here, okay? So we're gonna go ahead and just grab a very um, flat brush. We're gonna go grab a flat brush and we're gonna just grab that pinkish color over there. And then I'm gonna go ahead and grab a brown eyeliner. Any eyeliner that you do have, that will, that will definitely work. So I'm just gonna go ahead and put it uh, on my waterline like this. So after doing that, and we're just gonna go ahead and kind of like um, blend it a little bit. So I'm gonna go ahead and just use the end of my brush. Um, I've learned it somewhere, I totally forgot. I like to lighten it a little bit. There you go. Then I'm gonna go ahead and just grab another of the pink again, the same color, and we're just gonna put it on top of it. All right. All right, so I think I'm done already. I think that's pretty okay. It's very simple, it's very nice, you know, and good for, you know, morning. Um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and just shade my eyebrows a little bit just to be even and I'm gonna go ahead and grab my lashes and I will be back all right so I have done my eyebrows and I have done my lashes as well and I'm gonna go ahead and just put um, mascara on uh, my lower lash line and I'm using Maybelline the falsies uh, volume express so I'm gonna just put it um, I'm just gonna go ahead and put it over here like this so I am done basically like I'm not so sure if I really wanted to put color on my lips right now maybe I'll put a little bit not too much so okay so what I'm using is the Velvet Matte from Victoria's Secret. Um, I just put it just a little bit. And then I'm going to use Victoria's Secret Extreme Plumper. And it's in crystal clear. I just want to be very simple today. Well, of course, not without my lashes. <laughs> so you're just going to go ahead. I'm just going to squeeze just a little bit. There you go. Oops, it came back. There. Maybe that's good enough. All right, so I think I'm pretty much done for, I think I'm pretty, all right, so I think I'm pretty much done with this tutorial right now. I'm gonna go ahead and um, go meet my friends. And if you do like this video, this very simple makeup tutorial, please do sound your thoughts and comments down below. And if you have any suggestions for our, our next uh, makeup session or activity that you would like to do, let me know so that I'll be able to do something about it. All right, I'm going to go ahead and meet up with my friends right now. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. And if you have not subscribed to my channel, hit that subscribe button down there and the notification bell so you'll be notified when new videos come in. Until my next video, I appreciate your time. I will see you again soon. Bye.